How's it going everyone? Today we're going to take a look at how to convert one video format to another. In this case, I'm going to take an MKV file and convert that to MP4. So let's go ahead and open up our internet browser, whichever one you may use, and just type in VLC download. And uh, we'll do that right now. And here we have this video land.org link. I'll click this, which will take me to the download for VLC. And we'll just click download and give that a sec to download and we can install it. Then after we have that downloaded and installed, we can go ahead and open VLC. And in the top left here, we'll see this media button. We'll just click that. And then we're going to click convert slash save. And here is where we actually select the file to be converted. So I'm going to click add and I'm going to grab this file right here. As you can see, it is an MKV file. I'm going to click open and I'm going to click convert save again. Here it shows us the source file. This is where it's currently located and we have the convert setting selected, which is good. If we go down here, we can see the profile. This is just the format that we're converting it to. If you wanna change it to another one, you can, but I'm gonna keep it at H.64 plus MP3. And if we click this wrench here and go to audio codec, you can actually keep the original audio track. Sometimes I like to do this in case, uh, in case I initially convert it and there's no audio. This just ensures that you'll have the original audio track. And lastly, we just need to select a destination. So uh, I'm gonna click browse and I'm going to save this one to my desktop. And I'm just gonna remove that MKV extension. And as you can see here, it's gonna save as a MP4. And I'm gonna click save. And what's gonna happen is well, actually, sorry, after we click save, we need to click start, so click start. And then what's gonna happen is if you look in the top left here, you see converting file and it's gonna run through that conversion process. Now, just a quick little warning. Um, if you initially do this and you wait until this gets done and then you click it right away, it usually won't open. Uh, VLC or whatever editor you're opening it with will throw a fit. So I usually just like to wait a couple minutes give it some time to process. And then um, after that, you should be able to open it. It should run as an MP4 and you can use that MP4 file as you would any other MP4 file. So I'm just gonna wait for it to process and then we'll open it together. All right, so it's had some time to process. And now if we double click this, it should open up in our default video player. And yeah, I'm getting sound and everything. Although to be fair, I don't know how my OBS is configured. I don't know if you guys can hear it, but yeah. Hopefully you guys can see and hear the video and hopefully this method works for you. Um, I just discovered it myself, but I've used it on a couple videos and there haven't been any issues. So anyway, let me know if this helped you in the comments. If it did, leave a like. If it didn't, leave a dislike and I'll see you guys in the next video.